Hey there guys, it's Plumor here, back again with another A-side Hockey Manager video with the Nottingham Panthers, so uh, yeah, this is episode 2, if you missed episode 1, go check that out and uh, yeah, let's uh, look at some players that we could sign because this episode is going to be more recruitment based obviously we'll get the games in, obviously so let's look at Cody Payne and uh, yeah Let's see how this episode goes. Like I said last time, I like a team of younger players, more power forward type players. Mark Canton used to play for Coventry, so good luck at him. Anyway, let's uh, see what's happened. Danny Biega. I don't think he'd come to us. No, he wouldn't. Oh well. Let's see uh, what else there is about on the market. Might search up a few more players too to scout so that we can see uh, so we can see who we can sign for future. He won't come to us, Brady Austin. And uh, yeah, we won't really be signing much older players. Bill Arnold is only 25. He's an AHL player, very good one in that. Let's see if he'll come to us. 21,000. Uh, hopefully we can get him and um, yeah let's look for a few more maybe one more player and uh, see if we can sign anyone Matt Carey let's see this guy profile 25 year old he's a HL player don't really think we need defenders though so uh Ryan Martindale, AHL player again. Let's see if we can get this guy. Yeah, he costs quite a bit more than the last one that we offered for. Anyway, uh, Dane Bias being suspended. Very kind of off contract to Matt Keith. Steve Wagner as well. Um, scouting. Looking for a head coach now. Uh, we're off of some I'll be happy if we kept Nilsson but obviously we'll see about it we'll offer, offer for some and uh, if we get any upgrades then great but them guys are really expensive I'm not even sure if we'll be able to sign people at 100k over uh, 3 or 4 seasons but you never know hopefully we can always hope. I'll be happy with Corey though. We've got another assistant coach, so hopefully they'll be able to help us out. And uh, let's look for some people and how much they're worth. I don't really want that guy. Um, yeah, these guys are really expensive. I didn't think they'd be as expensive as this. I knew they'd be expensive though, but. Let's see, Peter Horacek, no, Adam Oates, is a, uh, Jesus, these guys, man, Ron Wilson, is a uh, 112, might be able to get him, let's offer him a signing bonus, that was quite a big signing bonus, but oh well, we'll see, we'll offer some more it, because why not, there'll be big upgrades if we can get them. Tommy Bowerstadt is not interested in joining Nottingham Panthers. I don't think, well, actually, quite a few of them are interested or will accept, but it's just that so many of them are too expensive for us because of the uh, game has changed how much money Panthers get to spend. It, they, we used to get like 40k per year for coaches and like around 100k for players. But that's changed, and now we only get around 27, I think it is, for players. Uh, 28k per year. Or per, for one player per year. But, oh well. Pierre Eric Giant Johnson, sorry. Uh, probably stop looking through them. Let's go, continue. 
Coventry have signed Bobby Gobfert as 34 year old goaltender uh, looking for a long successful reign and uh, ref fifth, yeah, that's not very good but oh well um, Mark Shantseff suffers injury we're approached by um, who was that? I didn't see that oh well uh, he's quite good, he's only 22, we might replace him now uh, Nicholas Halver and Garnett has resumed full practice which is good because he's a f very good goalie anyway see what's happening Czech Republic win Czech hockey games Nastyuk made available, Clements made available, Clements is now old I don't think and uh, yeah, I don't think Clements that old. He might be good if his stats were okay. We might look at him. Uh, no, his stats are not very good at all. Um, season tickets. Oh well, let's go forward. Nottingham set to sign Ryan Martindale. Let's uh, confirm that. That should bolster our squad a bit. Uh, we sign Martindale. Let's have a look, look at his stats. And then we'll sign ben Ar Bill Arnold. Uh, would he be on our team if we want to change anything? We, we're gonna get rid of some players, but some of them might be unpopular uh, people that we get rid of. Like people might not be too happy that we got rid of them, but oh well. Let's confirm. Continue. What chance if Mosey aren't playing? Mosey's stats aren't that good. Neither one much chance F. They're both fan favourites. I'll we'll probably get rid of them. Yeah, let's get rid of much chance F. Uh, Bill Arnold has agreed to terms with Nottingham and uh, sign him. Bill Arnold's 25 year old centre. I think the last guy we signed was centre. Yeah, he was as well. Uh, no, let's give him. No, nah, let's give him 21. But, uh. Yeah, Ryan Martindale, I didn't like that number, so gave him 21. Guilford Flames have made defenseman Brennan Yadlowski Yad available. Don't really want him. Brad Seal Canton deal. Used to play for Coventry. He's an interesting player. Nottingham assigned centre. Arnold, yep. Anyway, let's continue. Uh, actually, does he fit in our roster? There he is, centre, 25 years old. Lynn Hagen, we might get rid of. Yeah, let's get rid of him. He's centre and he's not as good as Bill Arnold, so. Anyway, let's go forwards. Next game is against Coventry. We rejected Panthers. It's offering a bit more, or quite a lot more, signing bonus. And uh, happy Declan Barmer. Dixon, Garnets, and Galbraith are in the top three of the uh, goalies for the league, so that's good. Both of them are our goalies. Uh, we've got Breezeboy and Spang and top defenders, and uh, top right left wingers are Shala, Rafael Busieres. Centers we've got Phillips and Bill Arnold. Then we've got <coughs> then we've haven't got anyone on right wing I don't think Prospects Riley Stadel is a guy I was thinking about signing for the next season team he's a young power forward he's not very big but he's still a power forward so Patrick Lee's young as well uh, I don't know we'll think about it later uh, Michael Mandat uh, I don't know much about him Kieran Brown, Josh Tello mm, Tello's not very good we might get rid of him this guy wants to sign for us, he's only 26, so, although I don't really fancy signing him. He's still a younger player though, like I said I was looking for, so, that's the sort of thing we'll be looking for in the future. Uh, three coaches reject the Panthers, so, we will just offer them more money, I guess. Anyway, let's see how this goes. Uh, we'll offer them all it basically. This guy wants four years. We've got John Chibolt. And lastly, Ron Rolson. It's a weird name, but 
He looks like the most realistic one if you were going to sign one. Uh, Guilford of Offer, Cameron Abney. He looks like a good player, to be fair. He's only 26, I believe. Guilford of Offer, Matt Keith and Tim McCoons, who's 30 years of age. Sweden, and then Koinos informed by Perti Shamila. We've got goalies, so. No, not really. It's gonna sign him, He's, we've got goalies. Now we're up against Coventry, and we won 8 2. That is an impressive first game in the league. I believe that's our first game in the league. Yeah, it is our first game in the league. Yeah, things right there. Martin Dale got a point, Arnold got a point. Arnold got another, it's Martin Dale, Martin Dale and Arnold scored the last two goals, so a new signing is coming in strong. Two good signings. Farmer got player of the week and two NHL Hall of Fame inductees. It's interesting. Uh, M games, uh, interesting. I'm not going to look at them, you can pause and look at them if you want. Savage being inducted into the Elite League Hall of Fame and uh, final season ticket figures. One. Wolfson has rejected us. Uh, let's offer him more. Let's offer him the max. Offer, yep, continue. Now we're up against Belfast and they win in overtime. Arnold scored. And uh, yeah, we lost in overtime. Dan Spank suspended. Uh, do I appeal it? No. We'll see what he gets after the review. Uh, Pierre Eric Johnson rejects us, suffering more money again. And uh, <coughs> sorry, and uh, Scouts watched Cody Payne, 23 year old power forward, five star player like Chris Lawrence. It'll be a interesting signing. Uh, more coaches reject us. It might be time that we just stop going after these guys after this contract. Uh, yeah, Willie really, really Destroy and, and John Chamont, Chamont I think, Ch Chabot, sorry, my bad. Um, Spang Bant for a game. Okay, we won't appeal it, we're just getting back after his suspension. Tim Coon signs with, for Guildford and... Uh, Abney. When I'm saying Coons, I'm saying his name, I'm not being racist by the way. Uh, we lost 4-2 to Guildford, that's not very good at all. And, uh, yeah, that's not good, we want to improve on that. Uh, get a brief start in there. Career milestone for Stephen Lee, appeared his 500 Elite League game. Uh, he doesn't want to re-sign at the moment, although it's still very early in the season, so don't expect him to. Brandon Brooks, career milestone. Uh, ejected. Mm, let's go forward. Rose Hill. Pierre. Or oh, we win in the shootout. Nice. Bussieres scores. Well, Shansef scored. Uh, in the shootout. Anyway, Matthew Breeze will be out for about three, two weeks. I think I said sorry. Yeah. Uh, it rejects Nottingham, great, again. I think we offered him the max last time, but we'll offer him it again, just in case we didn't. Where is this man? Hughes put on the block. This guy I was interested in. So, we'll offer him, offer the team £50,000 for Tommy Hughes. Uh, now we're playing Cologne, Colm, sorry. And we lost about three weeks after a pull groin, that's very good. Oh, I think he said pull groin. Uh, pulled hamstring, my bad, not pull groin. Uh, Gritty two way games, only 23. Big left winger. In real life, he was terrible, but we might sign him back. Scouts, scouts watch Stadel. This is the uh, thing I was wanting to see. Like Matthew Waugh, uh, power forward, five stars already. Lynn Hagen released, now a free agent. Uh, we we're able to offer a contract to Hughes. How much does he want? Only 6,000. Let's offer him two seasons. Uh, see if he accepts that. Springer uh, on the block. Oh, he's bad. Yeah, he's not good at all. 
We're not signing him. Set to sign Hughes already after one day. Well, I think it was one day. Set to sign him, we'll sign him. We'll get rid of Gagnon probably, because Gagnon's not the greatest, he's just more of a fighter. Yeah, Hughes' stats are much better than that, and Hughes is uh, tougher. So, I'm happy with our new signing in Tommy Hughes. And here he is, signed for us. 25 years old, left defence, or sorry, right defence. Uh, he's got higher stats in almost everything, other than aggression and balance and stuff like that. So, I'm happy with our new signing. Now we're up against Brayhead, where we win in a shootout 3-1. We need to start winning in regulation, guys. Phillips, Brown and Spang scored. I think that was Brown. Uh, player of the week is Manchester's player. Continue. Right well, now we're up against Guildford again. We win the shootout yet again. Hughes gets an assist. Hughes gets a goal as well from a defender. That's good. Uh, Galbraith uh, has requested to leave at his own request. Yeah, he can go. We've got two goalies. Two other goalies. He's rejected us again. Uh, approached by Philip Seaman. Yeah, we're not signing him. Uh, now we're playing Colne again, and we're out. They won on Advig on aggregate five one, so we're out of the CHL. Uh, yeah, looks like this is coming to an end this month. I'm gonna do it monthly. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please like subscribe and all of that stuff and uh yeah i'll see you guys next time breeze boy seems like practice thank you guys for watching please like comment subscribe for more i upload daily so definitely subscribe if you enjoyed stuff like this and ufc free and stuff anyway i'll see you guys next time and peace